Shopify order printer app tutorial. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how we can install and work with the order printer app into your Shopify store. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you are going to be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to head over to Shopify.com. Then you're going to sign in into your account and after that you're going to have the access of the admin dashboard. So now we are going to click on the search bar at the top. Then you are going to type in only printer or order printer, order printer like that. And here we have the Shopify order printer, as you can see. So I'm going to let you see it on the app store. So I'm going to open up the Shopify app store. Here we have a lot of, uh, as you can see app, uh, we have here the Shopify integrated one. So we are going to click on it. This is the official app. We are going to click on install. Wait for the installation right there. Boom, we are going to click on install again. Now we are going to see the app. The first thing that you need to do is to pin up the app to the navigation. Then here you have it. So whenever you are going to get an order, you're going to see it right there. So if you receive an order, you are going to see here it um, fulfilled. Then you are going to print it here, print order, make everything here. So we have here the templates and here we have a invoice and a packing slip. For the invoice, you can go ahead and see it. It is a code. This is obvious from Shopify. You can go ahead and create your own right there by setting the name and editing the code. So if you want to modify something here later on the uh, invoices or the packing slip, you're going to click on it. And here, as you can see from the code, we have the preview. So everything, if you are going to uh, modify something, you're going simply to uh, preview it right away. So I'm going to click on edit code. And before that, we are going to see here, what do we have? So maybe you are going to put here, let's see here, the edit code. We should not here um, make uh, some editing to the values, but only the words. For example, if order here, as you can see, we are going to see, we are going to uh, change the text. So here we are, have some values and these values, if they are uh, here added to a letter to it, they will mess up everything in the preview so you are going to set up here the for example here the word shipping you are going to see the word shipping and then you are going to modify it right there so you can go ahead and modify only some few things but i highly suggest for you to duplicate first the uh, the template then you are going to make the adjustment to it you're going to see here the copy you can go ahead and freely use it as you want. So you can learn more about customizing templates by visiting the help page uh, of Shopify like that. Then you are going to get the help of it. So that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.